What's going on guys? Micah here coming at you with vlog number eight of my 31 day vlogging challenge. I've been doing this for seven full days now. This is the eighth. I have to provide content and I have to escape the authorities because these guys despise vloggers. <laughs> I don't know why because everybody has a cell phone. Hope you guys can hear me. It's a bit windy out here. And then That's a beautiful horse. Can I pet? Where, is there spots that don't you don't, it doesn't not, want to be touched? Not the pace, but it's just because of company policy. Okay. This is a beautiful horse. Sorry. <laughs> oh. like, what is that? <laughs> it's curious, eh? What kind of horse is this? A quarter horse. A quarter horse? Mm -hmm. Where are you from? Germany. Oh, wow. How long have you been in the United States? 18 years? Yeah. So I'm assuming you enjoyed it. You're still here. <laughs> yes, I do. <laughs> Wow, what was your craft in Germany? Like, what did you do for a living? Engineer? Oh, hey, hey, they're awesome. Or he or she? She. How much does she weigh? 1,300 maybe by now. I'm Holy crap, how fast does she go? She's fast, or, she's not the fastest, but she's fast. Like, what but do you... we don't run her here on the property. Like, what do you think? How fast? Oh, hey. 30 miles an hour. Whoa. Okay, that means you want to go. It was a pleasure. Was a pleasure. <laughs> you have a fantastic you day. Too. See ya. You too. <laughs> so that was so cool. Horses are absolutely beautiful. The horse was kind of freaking out a little bit, like wondering what I'm doing at <laughs> this camera. I'm out here chilling, walking around because it's absolutely beautiful. See, I got to learn to talk a little louder. The problem I have is I'm not talking loud enough and I kind of muffle my voice when I'm in public, which I'm like, Ugh, maybe people are watching me, maybe people are watching, but whatever. Be bold. Hello, hello. I'm not where I'm supposed to be. I hope that you're missing me, because it makes me feel young. Food. I'm so hungry. <laughs> Hello, hello, I'm not where I'm supposed to be, I hope that you're missing me. Alright, all done, now on to tackle some social media. I gotta get some gas. Mm. Goodbye, goodbye, I said to my bestest buds, we said that we keep in touch. All right, so I used to do this thing, which you just saw, hashtag Gas Pump Chronicles. The idea is you're sitting there waiting for gas and you're not really doing anything. I don't think you're supposed to be on your phone because like the electricity or something, I'm not sure. So I was like, why not practice something? Besides your hands getting a little dirty, you can always wash your hands. It can be squats, it can be stretching, it can be anything. I preferably like to do handstands, so I would do handstands. All right, guys, so today's value is based on consistency. Anything in life that you want, you have to be consistent at. Uh, for instance, my journey. I started this whole thing. I started with personal training and then coaching, CrossFit coaching, gymnastics coaching, all this other stuff. I just stayed consistent with it. It wasn't making any money in the beginning, but then slowly it starts to generate income as you become more affluent at your discipline. 10 years, you become a master at something. So imagine doing something for 10 years and then you basically become a master at it. So how many hours are you putting into it? How much are you willing to sacrifice for whatever you want? Let me get back to the topic, consistency. So with this vlogging, this is officially, this is day, day eight now, sorry. And I could have quit because some technology malfunction or the processes aren't right, but that's not the point. The point is to stay consistent with whatever you're doing and refine your processes, become better. If you keep your old, dated, prehistoric processes, it's gonna be a problem. If you're not willing to adapt, you will fail. Experience. Experience is what you gain over time, and that helps you improve your systems and then be successful at whatever you wanna do. So my point, be consistent, whatever you're doing. That could be playing golf, that could be learning to handstand, that could be learning to lift weights, whatever. Take children, for instance. Nobody teaches them how to walk, because they can't understand. 
but they teach themselves. They don't stop. They are aggressive in what they want to do. So that's my words of advice from a 32 year old. Be consistent and uh, dial into what you want and uh, get out there and get after it guys. Thank you for tuning in. If you enjoyed the content, go a little, give a little thumbs up. If you'd like to see more content, go and subscribe and see where this journey takes me. Other than that guys, keep learning, growing and moving.